Okay, everybody, Doc Hydra here, December 5th, 2019, and it's currently about a quarter to one in the afternoon today. Although the time's not important, I just felt like saying it. Anyway, I, uh, I told you in the last uh, Engineers Challenge video that uh, the new website, wildfireengineer.com, would be coming up. And uh, it was really going to be dedicated to uh, you guys out there on the front lines with um, the engines, Type 4s sixes threes and just about whatever you got in the wildland environment um, and I wanted to basically do this screencast to show you what it looks like how to get to it and, and so forth so up on top you'll see here wildfireengineer.com all one word you don't have to put the HTTPS for secure um, I believe it's going to append that automatically, so if you just wanted to do the www.wildfireengineer.com, you could probably get away with that. Um, at the very top here, you'll see this. When you highlight it uh, or mouse over it, it'll show why if you just click on that, no matter where you're at, it'll always take you back to the home page. Okay, and then over here, I've got my telephone number. That's my personal cell number. And then here is the RSS feed. And uh, so if you click on that, you don't have to be a subscriber, although like everybody else, I'm going to re recommend that you do become a member and subscribe free. I don't log anything. I don't pass anything out. Uh, but uh, the reason that I'm telling you this now is because there's a couple of areas on here on the site that I restrict access to those that are members only. So at any rate, so you go to the main site. This is the main page. This is what you're going to see right here. And so over here, you're going to have all the recent posts, and then you're going to have any comments made. Uh, there was a standard Autobot uh, comment made. I just I deleted that. But uh, then over here, you have the archives by the month, then the categories. Um, engineer's log is one of those things to where I set it up specifically to where the people that are registered members could go in there. You don't have to be an engineer. It's kind of like a play on words, but... Uh, uh, it's just it, it's an area that's uh, restricted to uh, people that want to be members and talk about anything going on on their fires or whatever. Doesn't have to be with me. It can be with anybody. Um, and then you got the meta section, which is you know your register, login, uh, entries feed, and go to the WordPress.org website. So you'll see in here, it's like for this one here, engineers log. Uh, it's got who the author was. So that's me, wildfire engineer for the site. Um, and then the category, where it, where you can find it at is right here, and then the posted date in December. So uh, the way that this is, is uh, if you're familiar with blogs, I'm kind of new to it, but uh, there's some people that have been dealing with blogs longer than I have, so they understand that it's a reverse hierarchy. So if you come down to the bottom and scroll as far as you can get, you get the older posts. And so the introduction and then lesson one, because I've got, the main blog is all about the lessons, and so if you want to go to the uh, to the lessons, uh, I talk about the start with the introduction, lessons, properties of water, and so if you click on it, it would be the same effect of going to this tab here. I've got that ironed out, so you can get to it either way. And then it's going to talk about the properties of water and the heat and everything else, and I'm not going to get into all this because a lot of you folks have heard it, but you can always leave a comment, but in order to leave comments, you have to log in. So anybody can view the site and read it, but in order to post, you have, you have to register. If you want to post and ask a question to me directly, which I'll get notified by email, uh, again, you got to register for that. Um, so then we've, we've got that. So that's the main page. Uh, and then Pump Theory is still in development. And so what Pump Theory is all about is a place where we're going to talk about uh, the components of the pump, how the pump actually works, which is kind of the same thing covered in lessons, but this would be a little bit more to uh, some bigger degree. I, right now I've got placeholders as um, a cutaway of some water as pumps and then a poster of a CS pump and, and its components. And then if you click the link, uh, it'll open up in a new tab of this very same poster. And then I've got the description of engineer, uh, question mark. The reason I've got the question mark is a lot of people look at this and go, well, what is an engineer? Well, in the fire service, an engineer was uh, given with good reason. 
And the fire chief was called, he made chief not because of his political prowess or his uh, political influence. It had everything to do with the fact that he was the chief engineer of all things water. And that's, that's some history to that. But I talk about what this is and go into all of the details as you'll see down here. And then again, the lessons page, uh, that's the same thing as the, uh, the blog page. So if you click on that, which we'll see it come up right here, everything now deals with the lessons. So relay control, water control, pump, relay pumping, those are the last ones. Um, setting up for relays, some of the things that you need to think about. Drafting, uh, principles of drafting. Um, and then we've got, um, let me see here, calculating friction loss and then hose lays. Um, nozzle pressures, fire stream calculators, how those work. Calculating head pressure elevation and then pump pressure, what that means. And, um, and then I get into the introductions, you know, again, uh, parts of water uh, and terminology and so forth. And then on my products page, which a shopping cart is coming pretty soon, uh, it's not quite there yet, and it probably won't be for oh, maybe another month or so. But at any rate, um, I've got some products that I'm going that right now are offered up for free, but they're going to become pay only uh, because of you know cost. It's it, to, to do things for free just gets to be kind of pointless after a while. Um, you go broke. But right now the uh, uh, quick reference version 2.2 edition 3 is out and then I talk about um, the um, spreadsheet uh, engine pumping calculator and I have screenshots of, uh, of the sheets and a little description of what they're for and what I was thinking about when I was doing it and then of course the engineers challenge um, and then I've got the videos link uh, but the videos link uh, is nothing more than just links that point back to the uh, to the Wildland Apparatus Engineer YouTube channel. And then here's all the information that you would need uh, for the engineer's challenge, the map, and then the relay exercise um, videos. Then the gallery, there's nothing in the gallery. The about me section obviously talks about me and uh, my last 12 years into the uh, fire arena. And I cover um, things that I've done, what I've looked at, what I teach, and uh, what I'm able to do. Um, contact information. Um, you can definitely reach me in several ways. And so we'll pull this up real quick here, quickly here. So I've got two emails. The primary email is going to be hydro at wildfireengineer.com. Alternate is going to be wildlandengineer at gmail.com. Um, both of those will get directly to me and then my snail mail address and then my cell number and then you can fill out the contact form if you wanted to if you didn't want to open up a, uh, a, a separate browser for email and type that in. You can just give me your name, email, subject um, and then a quick message and then uh, we can go from there. And then again the engineer's log um, that's going to be the place, like I said earlier, that's going to be to where if you're a registered member, you can just comment and talk about anything. And if you click on it now without being inter, uh, logged in or registered, what will happen is the fact that um, you, will be, uh, you will be redirected and told that you'll have to uh, log into the site in order to partake with that. So we'll see if I've got that right. So. Uh, here is the uh, the thing right here. It's viewed for all, but to post you must register and be logged in. So that's where that is. And then if you're a registered member, then you can sit here and you can do a, uh, you can check your account. You can see other members, uh, uh, and then you got the contact information like I showed you. Um, but um, that's about it. That, but that's where you find it. Uh, you can get all the stuff uh, right here on the website. But uh, the products page and the lessons page, I'm expecting to be the most used page. I think it was November 4th I had already had 143 views for the day on that. Um, some of that was me doing the uploading and testing but the larger percentage was outside sources and folks from around the country. And so uh, so that's it everybody just a quick little uh, brief overview and then uh, if you're a registered member the uh, the gallery section will be uh, available so if you wanted to post pictures or do whatever uh, you could do that and uh, you could also have 
a section to where with your account you can have your own specialized um, avatars and background images and so forth but uh, hey it's a work in progress but again the I want to emphasize that the purpose of the site is for taking the PMS 419 engine operator course to the next level and allowing people to bring out the absolute maximum potential that they have within them to take maximum potential of their apparatus. That's the purpose behind this. And that's it. And with that, I'll close and bid you a good day. Bye-bye.